Vancouver woman who lied about an acid attack has now written a book about it. Bethany Storo tried to commit suicide in 2010 by covering her face with drain cleaner. She told police that somebody attacked her, but later admitted that she did it herself. KPTV's Julie Grower joins us live with more on this story. Julie. Well, Wayne, here's a look at photos of Bethany before and after she used the acid. And in her book, Facing the Truth, she writes about the mental illness that led up to her failed suicide attempt. On August 30th, 2010, Storo doused her own face with acid. She then lied to police that a woman attacked her. More than $25,000 in donations poured in, and court documents say that she did spend some of it. Eventually, she confessed and pled guilty to making false statements to a public official. She was sentenced to community service and mental health treatment. Since then, Storo teamed up with author Mona Kruger to write Facing the Truth, which is being sold on Amazon. Kruger, pictured here, is also a burn survivor after a car accident when she was 18. She says that it's important to share Bethany's journey with others who might also suffer from body dysmorphic disorder. In a statement, she wrote, many people have never heard of it. We have written this book together in hopes of raising awareness so others may seek psychological help before it takes a catastrophic toll like it did in Bethany's case. She had practically every classic symptom undiagnosed and untreated. On the Fox 12 Facebook page, we asked you if you were interested in reading her story. We have received hundreds of responses. The overwhelming majority of people say they won't be reading the book. Head to Facebook.com slash Fox 12 Oregon if you'd like to join the conversation. Reporting live, I'm Julie Grauert, the 6 o'clock news.